hey guys welcome back to my channel if you haven't subscribed well i hope you like this video and you'll want to subscribe after if you have subscribed thank you so much so today's video is going to be me unboxing some things that i got from eno couture um, but i'm also just showing you another small package that i got on the side which was um lavender violets gel polish that i purchased off of ebay and i got these colors for 99 cents so that was definitely exciting i love me a great deal and i also really like the lavender violets gel polishes they are really good quality i usually find them on ebay and they're about buy four get four free so i end up getting about eight gel polishes for twenty dollars which is really good and the quality of these are really good and they last pretty long. But I got both of these gel polishes for 99 cents on eBay with free fast shipping. I'm also showing you this uh, Model 1's um, base coat and top coat set that I got from Amazon. It came with a top coat, a base coat, and a matte top coat, and I was just comparing it to the old bottle. It definitely looks much cuter, much sleeker, and yeah, that's pretty much it for the mini haul. Let's get into what I purchased from Eno Couture. Now, if you don't know about Eno Couture, um, Eno Couture is a website, and it sells really beautiful pink glittery nail products. Um, the issue that a lot of people have been having with them and the issue that I also experienced myself is that their shipping was absolutely horrible. It was a nightmare. I mean, I ordered from them um, in the beginning of the year when the pandemic started and I could say that I ordered in from them in like March and it was July, August and I still had not received anything. So I actually filed a dispute with PayPal and I got my money back that way because they don't respond to emails. The customer service was just absolutely terrible. Anyway, fast forward to a few weeks ago where he actually announced on his Instagram that they now had fast shipping and that most orders process within two weeks. And I was like, what? No, I don't believe this, but... I decided to give it a try and I paid with PayPal and I was like, hey, if this doesn't work out, I'll just dispute it again. Um, and to my surprise, guys, the second day after I ordered, I got tracking information from FedEx. And guess what? My order was then here in three days. So it took five days from when I ordered to get it. So that was super exciting. And I'm, I'm glad, I'm really, really glad about this because opening his products, I can just tell that they're super cute and it's just so exciting. Like you could just look at the way this was wrapped in this like pink polka dot paper and it just gets you really excited. These are paint gels from Ina Couture. Now these paint gels are not for me. I am making my sister a mystery box for her birthday. Um, and I got her all of these paint gels because I know that she's been having her eyes on paint gels and she wanted something like this. Um, so she didn't mention that she wanted the Ina Couture ones, but I took advantage because they have some really cute colors. I mean, look at all of these, right? And the bottles are super cute. And it looks like you get a nice amount of painting gels here. So I'm really not mad at this. And I like that they have the nude paint gel because I don't see that often. You kind of just see like your regular colors. So that was really cool. I was actually just going through and counting to see how many paint gels I had and also verifying the colors because I thought that I had purchased another color and I actually didn't. Now, 
The thing about Ino Couture is I like their products. They're good quality products and they're very well priced. But I do not like his website at all. I feel like his website is so hard to navigate. So like everything is kind of just numbered and you pick from a drop down menu, you pick the color, the number of the color you want. And that can get really confusing. So yeah, if I could change one thing, it would definitely be that. I got these Lux brush wipes. They are lint free wipes. They are pink, which is super cute. And they're also really, really strong. So they can be used to clean off your acrylic brushes or to clean the nails when you're done prepping them or you know after you top coat them if you want to swipe them with some alcohol I use these with my acrylic brush and I will say that it actually cleaned it off really really well even better than a paper towel so it definitely absorbs more and I really like that so I'm just checking out my invoice trying to see like okay what else was here I only paid two dollars for the brush wipes for 50 really really good guys and I had bought like three because I wanted them so badly and then like I said before I was making a mystery box for my sister for her birthday so a lot of this stuff I got duplicates of I got the press on gel. I already have the base gel. I actually got the October nail boxy, which was Eno Couture. It had his one, two, three gold nails, the base gel, the flashy, and um, it doesn't have press on gel. So I wanted to try the press on gel because he said that that was like a stronger, better way. And it's also like builder in a bottle. So you could use it as a builder gel too. Um, I got some files. I hadn't tried his files. Some files and some buffers. Really cute. I mean, they're purple, gray, and pink. And they feel really strong. So, I really like that. Um, I like to have the 80-80 grit um, filer to file my nails and shape them. But this 100-100 grit on this file actually felt really strong and sturdy. So, I really like that. Um, this here was the, I believe this is the rainbow kind of top coat. And guys, it's just so pretty. Like, when you put this on your nail, it gives it like a metallic chrome kind of touch to it. And of course, I bought two because like I said, I got a lot of duplicates because I was making my sister her box. But when you put this on, it just gives it, like, a really cute touch. And I feel like this is, like, a good cover-up. Like, if your paint job isn't that great, you could always put this on top and it'll really fix it up. So, like, let's say you're trying to do a gel ombre and the fade is not flawless. You put that on there and nobody would know. I also got this, um, basically it's, like, a little rhinestone storage case. And um, this is where I'm going to store the luxury 3D flowers that I got from Nails by Ty. If, you not, if you're not sure what I'm talking about, you can go and watch my last video. So you can see the flowers that I'm talking about, which are really cute. I'm going to store them in this case. Oh, here I am showing you what I'm going to put in there. So... These are from Nails by Ty. I got these in my nail boxy, but I also went ahead and purchased some from him, from his website myself. And I plan on putting the flowers in there so that you get, um, so that you guys can see this is where I'm going to put them. And I want to put them there because I think they're going to look really cute and then I can access them really quickly. So again, I got another one of these, which I'm going to add that into my sister's mystery box. I'm also going to give her some luxury 3D flowers from Nails by Ty. So maybe she would want to store them in there. Or maybe she'll want to put her stones or her charms in there. This 
Uh, other thing that I got is called Remover Magic, and this is actually to help you soak off gel polish, the one, two, three, go nails, and even acrylic. Of course, you have to file off the shine first, and then you will place this on and leave it there for like five minutes and it will start breaking down the product and then you will continue to file just like you do when you're soaking um i tried this after the video with the one two three go nails and it worked really well and now what's cool about this is that it has like a super thick consistency um and you just put this on oh my god so funny story about this i don't know why i bought this um i bought these toe tips my nails i was doing gel a lot and filing them at the salon not anymore now i soak them off um but at the salon they would file them and they got really thin so they were kind of breaking and i like the look of acrylic nails sometimes on the toes so you know i decided to give it a try but these were an epic fail because <laughs> these things are so wide like honestly i could use a size zero nail um like a fingernail on my toe and it would be perfect these were so wide i don't even know who has toenails that are this wide and they were also kind of short i don't know why i thought that they would be longer sharper like just more square they were like a toenail that I would not want to wear. So yeah, that was an epic fail. And those were $14.99. There also weren't any clear pictures on their website. And I haven't seen anybody unboxing this. So yeah, I, will. I wouldn't recommend it. If you want to buy it, you can. But yeah, I wouldn't recommend it. This cuticle nipper, really, really good. Um, this is really good too for doing your pedicures. This thing was strong, like it was sharp. I tried to get some dry skin off my toe the other day with this and it was off in a second. I also got this color palette. So he said that in here you could use this to mix your colors or you could also store some stones in there. By the way that it looks, you could put stones in there, but I feel like it would get really messy. So for now, I'm just going to use it to mix up polishes or make some colors i used it the other day where i placed some builder builder gel in it and then i placed glitter and mixed it up and the cool thing is once i close it it doesn't dry up so i kind of have it there and you could try mixing different colors with it so in here i got play gel black so it explains what's in here the play gel black is a black spider gel so they call it play gel. I think they call it fun gel as well. And it's basically just spider gel. So, I mean, so far I'm really loving everything that I got. In here you can see that I got the black spider gel. And then I got these moon shaped cuticle bits. These are for cleaning up the cuticle. They were only $1.99 and I used it after the video and it did a really nice job of cleaning it up. So that was a really great deal and a really great price. So if you want something like that, you can purchase it from Eno Couture and get a really good deal on it. Okay. And also if you saw the other thing was Quickie Brush Glue. I used that to put on my nail tips um, and I'm sure you can do other things with it. But I just really, really like that. So I was happy about that. Especially because the glue is supposed to dry fast. And when I used it, it did dry fast. Like within 30 seconds, the nail was completely dry. So it looks like I have reached the bottom of my package. Which is the saddest time of the day. But yeah, Eno Couture is definitely working on their shipping. And you can order for them and try it out. And I think you'll be really happy with your purchase. So thank you guys for watching this video. And please don't forget to like and subscribe.